Hey everyone, Hot Wheels recently did a Gran Turismo themed set and I really like this one in particular. This is the 2020 Ford Shelby GT500 and it looks absolutely awesome. Um, lots of detail here which I'll show you. Look at that rear lights, front, top, side, it has got everything and as a result it looks utterly fantastic for Hot Wheels. Um, I do have uh, like an Auto World, um, similar Ford but you know for Hot Wheels it looks absolutely fantastic so I can't wait to show you this in detail. If you're interested in Transformers or diecast cars, please do consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you. Those of you who have really, really appreciate it and I hope you enjoy my reviews. Always happy to read the comments, especially those who've got similar toys and you're hearing your thoughts about it. Okay, here is the packaging for this. Gran Turismo, the real driving simulator. And I think they had some JDM, some Nissan Skylines. This is the 20 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500. And I can't wait to look at all those tampos and designs. Ah, uh, yes, here we go. Here is the rest on that list. So we have the BMW 73, the Porsche 911, GT3. This is the one that everyone was going on about, but although it's an amazing car, I prefer it made by other brands like Eno 64 or even Tomica, to be honest. Um, this is the 20 Toyota GR Supra, which I think is a little diddy, a little small for the scale. And here we have the one that I wanted out of this set. Okay, here we go. Usual stuff, pause if you are interested, got some cool license and sponsors there. But other than that, let's get this open. An awesome artwork there. This is impressive. So here we have the front. Look at all this detail. Let me zoom in here. Here we go. Look at that Shelby. Hit it, hit tampo work hit it right there. Got the grill, even got a little cobra in that grill design. And then we've got various lights here. Got this front lip splitter here. Ford logo done really nicely. Cobra's there. Gran Turismo Racing label badge. So it's a little bit, I don't know, it seems a little bit off. Like, should that be in the square? Anyway. And then this one's cool, we've got Gran Turismo across the windscreen, plastic windscreen there. On the side, similar labels. And you notice the plastic base comes out to form a lip here. Shelby font looking awesome with that Cobra again. Our beautiful domed appearance here, really nice. And we've got silver rimmed racing wheels on the back yes look at these back tampo got those classic three light pattern the racing white racing stripe comes all the way down here metal spoiler and on the back bottom got these four exhausts right here awesome detailing and on the other side it is the same. Now if you look at this, there's an, the rim is not just like a pattern on uh, a normal Hot Wheels. You can see straight through that rim right there, which is super cool. Uh, I didn't know Hot Wheels made their wheels like that. So that's really nice to see. The other side is the same as well. We've got this massive section here in plastic in the middle of the engine area of our vents 
and underneath, made in Thailand. And there we go, lots of cool details. Awesome looking vehicle. Okay, let's get this guy on the turntable. I don't think we can see inside much because the reflective, yeah, it's quite difficult to see. But we can see the steering wheel here on and the dash. Okay. Damn, what a cool racing car. Love it. Comes in a rich blue paintwork paint and um, the livery with this all these cool racing sponsors and all this stuff. Really, really nice. Even got metal wing mirrors here, which is cool to see. And yeah, just absolute. I've got the two little modules here on the engine as well. Lots of details here. And if you make dioramas, this would be a great car in the background to have. Or even, you know, as the main image. Really nice casting. What a cool livery. Great stuff. Okay, let me know what you think in the comments below. Do give this video a like if you enjoyed seeing all the details and see you in the next video. Take care.